thing makes me feel extra short. Welcome to see you, HP. Hello, how are you? My name is Amanda Briggs, Plenty Wright. Um, I'm really grateful for this honor. It was a big surprise. Um, and I've jokingly actually been asking for a superhero cape, so to see that, it was kind of cool. <laughs> um, um, it's strange being called a hero, uh, strange being called a leader in my community. I still very much feel like a little Klamath girl at the back of the room who's supposed to be quiet while the elders are paving my way. Um, so I'm just starting to get used to the idea that I'm helping pave that way for somebody else. Um, and I'm really grateful to be part of this community and having the service that I do for both of my communities, um, really like, I guess, bridging the gap between our communities. Um, as a two-spirit person, I didn't feel like I fit in this community, this building that I'm standing in right now when I first got to town. I didn't see my face and I didn't see my culture and that's what's important to me. That's what I wake up as every morning. That's what I pray as at every meal. That's what I go to sleep praying as. And so I didn't feel like I fit and then um, I was shown differently um, by a group of two spirits in Seattle. And for the longest time I drove up there to Seattle to have a sense of community and feel like I could be my total self. Um, which was that native cultural, that cultural role, um, along with my sexuality. So um, it's really nice to be able to stand here in front of you today, um, living in Portland now for 15 years, and finally feeling like I fit in both of my communities. I really started Portland Two Spirit Society just as a social group because I wanted to feel in town here what I was feeling in Seattle and what I was feeling when I was going and traveling to Montana Two Spirit um, gatherings. Um, so I wanted to recreate that here, and um, more than anything, like it took me by surprise because it just took off, um, and it didn't even go to a social group. It went right to youth education, which really surprised me. And thankfully, I had a background in public health education and was able to kind of hit the ground running with it and um, start a youth curriculum and travel around. And within a month, I was speaking at youth sexuality conferences about um, Two Spirit 101. Um, and what it is to be Two-Spirit. So that really took me by surprise, but I'm really honored to have that place in my community um, and to be paving the way for my three daughters. So I just want to say thank you. And, um,